And on this next scandal, we'll be excited about our next comic. Put those hands together for Sean Flanagan! What's up, New York? Oh, 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 New York City. Anybody yeah. here from New York? Any real New Yorkers? Yeah. Oh, fuck yeah. Holy shit. <laughs> Are you in therapy? <laughs> I hope so. Jesus Christ. <laughs> we got a lot of PTSD, am I right? Public transport stress disorder. Yeah. Forget ancestral trauma. We've got transit trauma, am I right? Yeah. I'll take a quick poll. How many people here took the subway tonight? Anybody? Yeah, a lot. Of, okay, was it crowded? No. No? Yes? Well, now picture this. You're on the subway. Door opens. Bing bong. Mariachi band comes on. If he does one more reba, I'm gonna reba that Morocco up his fucking butthole, okay? That's real New Yorker shit. Another guy comes on, he's like, hey, I got jokes, one dollar for one joke. You're like, what am I, made of chuckles over here? Can't you see I'm on my way to a comedy show? Get the fuck out of here. That's my New Yorker intro. My name is Sean, I'm an alcoholic. She gets it. Fuck yeah. What's your name? Gary. Oh shit, how long are you sober? 45 years. 45 years, yeah. Holy shit, 45 years in a row? <laughs> Congratulations. I've got three and a half uh, years sober in a row. Yeah. I was raised Irish Catholic, so the last time I did that was in the womb. <laughs> I made it to puberty and my dad said, congratulations son, you are now in the CIA Catholic Irish alcoholic. You're gonna answer the big man upstairs. You got a long history of shame and secrecy, and you might get killed off at any point. Sorry, kid. If they offer you a martini, shake and not stir, just say I'll mainline it direct to my veins. Thank you very much. I got sober, by the grace of God. I uh, was drinking, and then I went for a drive, uh, and I got into a little scrape, so I called up the hotline. I said, hi, I'm Sean. I'm an alcoholic. They said, sir, this is AAA, not AA. <laughs> I said, I know, I'm just trying to explain why my car is in the lake right now. <laughs> Thank God I'm sober, because uh, I'm a school teacher. Give it up if you like school. Yeah. All right, yes. fucking nerds. <laughs> I'm just kidding. What's your favorite subject? Drinking. <laughs> <laughs> Double Darren, social studies, drinking. <laughs> oh man, you guys are funny. No, these kids are cool too. Give it up if you like kids. Do you have them or you just like them? Just, just like them, they're funny. They got, they're, they're funny. There's one kid who always comes in, he says, Yo, 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 Sean, you got mad riz. I say, what's that? He says, oh, you know, funny, crazy, cool. I say, oh, like charisma. He says, what's that? Some old man word. I'm like, actually, it's your mom's stripper name. Burn! I mean, did you guys know what Riz meant? Yes. You're capping. <laughs> <laughs> this kid got me back, though. Uh, I was teaching during the earthquake, remember that? Yeah. And uh, it went off, and I was like, oh my god, what was that? This kid says, your mom just fell off a stripper pole. <laughs> I was like, joke's on you, kid. My mom's dead. <laughs> he starts crying. <laughs> Worst your mama joke ever. I'm like, no, look, kid, it's all good. It was a long time ago. I was 15. She died of an overdose. He's like, I'm eight years old. <laughs> I was like, okay. So I went back to my therapist. Uh, <laughs> My therapist and I, we have a long history together. Uh, we talk a lot about the uh, five stages of grief. They are, you know, uh, shock, and then anger, and then bargaining, depression, and acceptance. But what people don't talk about is the sixth stage of grief, which is masturbation. <laughs> Not like, wow, I'm thinking about my dead mom, because then I would come, but... <laughs> 
my therapist loves this show, because I'm glad that you guys do too. Anyways, flashback to this kid. He's like, that's a lot of information for social studies class. And I say, look kid, I'm gonna tell you like it is. The golden rule of comedy, you listening? Tragedy plus time equals comedy. He's like, all right, that's pretty good. I'm like, even shorter, just two words? Fuck it. He's like, all right, I learned something today. Thank you so much. That's about it for me, thanks so, so much, everybody. Take care.